Welcome to Spacecraft Guide, the channel that describes how the most complex and historic spacecraft work. It's the end of the year, so that means January 1st, 2023, our prices will be going up. So if you act now and uh, purchase a Patreon tier, your price will stay at the 2022 level forever. And if you're a Patreon member, and you get someone to join our Patreon page, I'm going to have a special uh, tier for you that's going to have our next spacecraft uh, incorporated. So you'll get this, the Apollo 11, plus another spacecraft that I'm going to be working on next year. So remember, join this month. Not only will I give you this year's price, the the December 22 price, but I will give you the month of December free until the end of the year. And then the prices go up and the free vi uh, viewing goes away too. In this issue of Spacecraft Guide, we're going to continue our work on the lunar module and continue our work on the panel 12, which is the communication panel and the ICS volume switch, or volume switch. When you click on this, it takes you to the intercom system ICS volume thumb wheel. Now, what this does is it permits continuous adjustment of the level of received intercom system audio feed to the headset amplifier. So if we want to see what that does, let's blow this up just a little bit. Go down to the intercom system switch here. We'll see the intercom system volume thumb wheel. As we move it up to increase, that increases the volume, which that goes into the diode switch, comes up to the voice headset amplifier, the commander's master volume, which is right there, and then going on to the headsets. So that is how the volume switch works. That's all for this week. If you would like to use this interactive virtual reality exhibit on the command module, the lunar module, and the surface of the moon, just go to our Patreon page and the link will be down below.